hello guys good morning happy saturday today is april 22nd oh hi welcome my name is martha if you are new happy to have you here subscribe and if you are back welcome back so <clears throat> i'm actually blow up giving myself a little blowout with my dicey night wrap because i'm actually going to georgia this weekend i'm leaving today later on today um like in the afternoon but i'm just gonna go ahead and blow out my hair i did self tan so i'm looking a little orangey here but um yeah so i am going to georgia this weekend because i'm going to a master class tomorrow um which is by an artist that did like miss universe and also i was watching his instagram stories thursday which was the latin american awards and he did a makeup for um oiga tanyon so that was really exciting to see so i'm really i'm actually really excited i'm really anxious very i don't like i kind of i don't know what to expect i've never had this like i've never done this before i've never to experience like this before and honestly shout out to my girl Giselle because she's the one that really pushed me to go because I was kind of like I I don't know because like first of all I think it's in Spanish but for sure it'd be like both but my Spanish sucks so I was kind of like uh but she pushed me to go and we're supposed to eat tomorrow breakfast before we go into the class so I'm really excited to see her and yeah so I'll talk more about it later but right now I'm just gonna do my hair and then I'll probably do my makeup but I'm not leaving until later but I do plan on going to like Target and then hopefully if I can make it to Sephora. But I don't know. We'll see. Um, kind of just depends on the drive, the traffic. It's about three hours and a half away from where I live. So yeah, I was going to leave like tomorrow morning, like not stay the night. But they did offer us like a hotel we wanted one. And then just said, I was like, girl, you should just stay because um, I'd have to be leaving here like at honestly three in the morning probably and that was just gonna be a whole thing and what if there's traffic and you just never know honestly especially in georgia so yeah um so and, and also the ho the class is at the hotel so that's gonna be easy you know but yeah i'm just gonna do my hair and yeah let's go i'm done with my hair now and let me tell y'all so need a big tripod i only have this little one i only have this little one and you can't extend it um i want to tell you i don't think i've ever did i don't know if i've ever used the dyson on my vlog channel but i have the dyson and i've had it since oh i can't even remember i want to say last year early last year and i got it because i redeemed all my auto points for it i had that much worth of auto points so i had been saving though purposely for the dyson airwrap because i wanted it for free so got the dyson airwrap and when i first got it um honestly i was like mm, this is not worth what it's worth what it's cost the cost to like, this is not worth it and really did take me a while to get used to it uh when i first did it i used like the brush and it wasn't for my hair my hair's curly i have curly roots like frizzy yeah so it didn't work and then finally the only thing that had worked to give me the little blowout look was obviously the blowout brush but um now indeed i do always have to go in with a straightener because my roots are always just frizzy and, you know, curly hair products. I use good products in my hair and stuff, so it's not like that. I used this one today for the first time, the Wow, because I have, this one's the one I always use, the Kendra one, but I think these are like two different things. Um, anyways, so yeah, like I like how it looks like, so the first few times I had tried the guy at Dyson, it really was, I was like, okay, it's not that good. Well, I had to practice with it, of course, and I got the hang of it more. I do like it better now, but I wouldn't spend what it's worth, what it's cost, what it costs. I would not spend that much money on it. So in that price, in the pricing of that, I wouldn't say it's worth it. But I do see now the Shark Beauty one. Um, if I didn't have the Dyson, I would buy that one because it's way cheaper. Still expensive, but way cheaper. Um, 
anyways so i like the curls it gives me but like i said i always have to go with a straightener but i like the idea because i do have curly hair i've always had to wash like go to sleep with my hair wet and let it air dry and then straighten it in the morning or i had to like straighten it blow dry and then i mean wash it blow dry and straighten it and i hated blow drying my hair so i like the whole kind of two in one step because i can like smooth it out blow it out and then with the straightener just going through it's and kind of also the little blowout look is also in style so it's kind of more helpful too so i have my straightener this is the baby bliss baby bliss baby bliss straightener i think there's something on my camera hold on and also i have this bag this bag i got it specifically to fit my dyson air wrap like fit all the little things in here my brother got me this for christmas but i just have like my little hair hair care hair care things in there um anyways um so also i don't know if y'all can see it but i've had a rash on my neck like all right here for like the past three weeks i don't know what it is and i feel like i had a little bit over here but more over here i don't know what it is because first of all i haven't changed my products and also i feel like if it was like a skincare product it would have been like all over my face so i don't know what it is and i had just been itching and i put some crema on it to yesterday but it's even like all the way up here and it was like right here too i don't know but anyways um self tan last night and i put tan on it not thinking about it and it kind of made it worse made it look darker so yeah anyways gonna talk to you guys a little bit about this class oh i did get a sephora package because sephora vip sales vip sales going on but by the time i post this video it will be over um but anyways um yeah i got a few things i'm gonna make a haul like on tiktok but i'm still waiting on another package and then i'm gonna i want to go to sephora today to exchange, exchange some things and get something else so I'm just going to wait for that. I already did my skin prep and stuff, so yeah. Also, I already kept packed my makeup. I'm just going to use like what I have in my makeup drawer because I obviously have that much makeup. But um, like I was saying, I'm very excited for this makeup class. I was kind of like nervous and also it wasn't the cheapest, but I was like, you know what? I might as well right so i'm excited for it excited to learn all the things that i can learn and grow in things also because i have a wedding next weekend so that will be interesting anyways um well let me tell y'all the class is like it's called like look para cameras which would be good for bridals honestly anything has to do with professional um like pictures being taken but i mean honestly in general because the lady she was like the class was for people that don't know much about makeup and know more about makeup so it's kind of for anybody so that's why i was kind of like more like okay yeah i have a wedding next weekend so i'm excited for that because I hopefully i can apply some tips that i learned tomorrow for the makeup saturday so yeah pretty busy these next few days next few saturdays i'm at also this class is like i want to say it's like six hours long i think it said almost seven i think okay so i'll talk to you guys later when i come back from doing my makeup hey google next oh my gosh hey google shuffle mexican playlist on spotify Oh. Got it. I'll shuffle your Spotify playlist called Mexican. Bro. Hey guys i'm actually about to leave the house right now it's about to be one o'clock i um, have to go like to the bank to the gas get gas and then i'm gonna buy the go by the restaurant and eat so i know i'll be there for a little good minute 
So, yeah. Um, we're gonna go ahead and leave. Just have on this little outfit. Nothing major. Like I said, when I get there, I want to go to like the mall and maybe Target. I don't know. I'm just gonna probably be hungry when I get there. So I'll probably just get some food and go to the hotel. Um, I don't know. So yeah. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm officially leaving now. It's 2 o'clock. Gonna get gas and things. Um, and, yeah. Let's see. Oh, of course I'm going to hit traffic once I get in Atlanta because it just showed right now. But, let's go. Hi guys, so I just made it to the hotel. This cute little bathroom and, um, uh, Love that there's a mirror. Here's a shower. Here's the mirror. Pretty cute. So yeah, almost like seven o'clock. Probably just gonna hurry up and like run to Sephora, see what I find, and then come back or something. Hello guys, it's like ten, almost eleven, and I just got out the shower. And I went to the mall earlier, got me some food, and now I'm back. So I'm not gonna do my skincare yet. I'm gonna just spray this one here. But, anyways, just wanted to tell y'all that I'm gonna be up early, so I'm gonna be going to sleep very soon. So, yeah, good night, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow in the morning. Bye. Good morning guys, it's like 6.50 and I'm about to get ready, do my skincare and start on my makeup. I'm excited for this master class but also nervous but I think it's gonna go really well. Moves throughout the year so now in the morning, so right now the sun's up. I am ready. We have to wear all black, so I'm just wearing these black leather pants, this black shirt, and I'm gonna wear my sneakers. I'm gonna go get breakfast, and let's go. Say hi to Giselle. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Monday now. It's the next day. I never ended yesterday's vlog. I got home like at nine o'clock and got straight ready for bed. So yeah, let me just talk about this class that I took yesterday. It was so much fun. It was so good to experience this. I've never experienced nothing that I had to do ever with makeup like this, much less a master class. And I was just really got excited to join. Um, so the guy that I went to go for his master class, him and his team are the ones that do Miss Universe. And they've been doing it since 2015, I believe he said. And so it was really good to see that. Really good to know 
behind the scenes of Miss Universe, the makeup that they do, the details that goes into it. It was really good to find all that out and really good to see other people and how they did makeup and how they got into makeup and just to see everyone's different techniques, how they work and everything because we were able to see that. Um, but it was really, really fun. Um, I did not audition because there was like, you could audition to be onto the team of Miss Universe. I, however, did not audition. But um, Giselle Ramirez um, that I showed in, she did audition and she made it to the top 12 out of like it was about 50 so i'm really proud of her for making it to the top 12 she did so good and yeah i know it was like really huge like it was time also like makeup was but like you believe you have all this time to do makeup and then it's like all these last details because that's what he said like one thing is just like details it's what really matters and that is really true so really glad i got to experience this experiences thank you so much to Giselle for inviting me to telling me about it and i'm just so glad to have gone and met other people too and had them follow them on instagram and stuff so it was really fun and really exciting so i'm gonna go ahead and start working on this vlog so i can get it up hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next one bye